In 2018, the first native North Carolina gas was put into the natural gas pipeline. And it wasn't gas that came from below the Earth's surface. It was gas that came from hog farms. Capturing the biogas from each of these participating farms significantly reduces the greenhouse gas emissions from the state. Uh, renewable natural gas that is derived from biogas is recognized as some of the cleanest, most carbon negative fuels that we can consume as a country. Uh, we capture all the emissions, we capture all the biogas, so I think that's important not only for the farmer but for the community. And it also provides an economic uh, benefit to the farmer. Um, you know, this project is a multi million dollar project uh, in an area that's very rural that needs that type of uh, investment. As we continue to grow as a population, as we continue to demand more high quality fresh foods, it's a very energy intensive process. This is a way that our farms in North Carolina can not only solve our food issues, but also solve our energy issues. It's really amazing. It's a very similar reaction by everybody I, t I, I bring out here. Uh, and you know, there's other farms like this. And so when I take people to farms, their first reaction is, wow. This is really neat. I didn't know you could do this, you know? And so, you know, the perceptions of a hog farm are very different from the realities of a hog farm with or without biogas. It's our vision and our stated goal that 90% of the finishing farms in Eastern North Carolina would have manure to energy projects on them in the next 10 years. It fits in with the values that North Carolina hog farmers and America's hog farmers have. And that is to be good neighbors, take care of the environment, and to continue to reduce our impact on the world around us.